Incidentally, given his bias towards social planning, it's hardly surprising that Rifkin has been adopted as an authority in China, which under his inspiration is presently embarking on another gigantic Chinese sociological experiment. It is designated, ironically, from the standpoint of these panelists, I'm sure, as social credit. Uh, the experiment involves implementing a system of comprehensive detailed surveillance and centrally controlled rewards and punishments <laughs> that would have been unrealizable before the computer age. Needless to say, it is a system antipodal to the social credit objectives espoused by C.H. Douglas. <laughs> 